look at that Scandinavian mural. Here's the marina market where you can get a Ludafisk TV dinner, among other Scandinavian things. So we're headed to Cargo Hold, which is Doug Owen's place. So here's Main Street in Paulsbo. Oh, look, there's Cargo Hold. What do you know? And look, a cigar sign in the window. All right. He's got all kinds of nautical stuff here. I see him in there. I think he's seen me. So, it's a cool shop. And he reacts to other dogs, but loves people. I'm carrying some. See a little pound hinge to tie your dog up outside. Ooh, it's warm in here. There's Doug. Look at all this cool nautical stuff. We'll try a video, Doug. I don't know. You know, you never know how these things are going to come out. I mean, look at this place. Is this not just totally amazing? Blinded by the shiny brass. All the bells. Nautical stuff, cool stuff, guy stuff. If you need a little brass plate for the head in your boat, you know where to come. Yes, indeed. Ah, and look, here's the tobacco part of the store. Yes. So, Doug. Doug Owen over there. Hello. Longtime proprietor of the cargo hold. 21 years. 21 years. There are people probably smoking pipes watching this that aren't 21 years old. I'm sure there are. I'm sure that, that is certainly Much younger true. than both of us. Yeah, exactly. Yes. But, oh yes, look at this little selection of Petersons here. Actually, a nice selection of Petersons. Yeah, it's always been my favorite pipe, so I got Oh, yeah. Lighters. <clears throat> Sabinelli's. Lots of tin tobacco. More fun tin tobacco down here. Uh, it goes on and on. Of course, cigars. Are the, oh, those are humidors. Oh, yeah. You know, in our climate, I, my cigars always stayed pretty good. Sometimes I think I just am wasting my money on the humidors. Uh huh. Yeah. Because Except on a summer. Well, in the summertime, of course. Yeah. Even though in the summertime it's still pretty humid. Yeah. Right. You no, know, humidors are uh, a nice uh, way to guarantee that they're going to stay fresh. Uh -huh. yeah. Right, yeah. right. Yes, indeed. So, you didn't build the ship models, did you? No, you would be giving me way too much credit for talent if I took credit for those. Those are done by local guys. Are they really? Uh, most wow. all those are done by local people. Uh, huh. What's called plank on bulkhead construction. It's very uh, meticulous work. Right. And so, it's built with little planks. Yeah, those oh, planks on the Victory here, oh, yeah. each plank is individually laid. Wow. Uh, it's what's called a double plank tall, actually, because there's a planking uh, under a row of planks underneath this row of planks. Wow. And the second row is put on to give that nice, smooth look. So uh -oh. when guys build these, they're kind of building like they built the real ships. Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah. Wow. Cool. Okay. Well, I just wanted to... Oh, look, more cigars that I had missed the last time That's I was here. Is that new? That's the closeouts. Oh, the closeouts. Ooh. Three bucks a pop there. Wow. There's some $10 cigars in there, but they're nice. closeouts, but, you know, they're fine. Nice. Oh, look, the Endeavor. Cool. Very nice. Very nice. Just, you sailboat, huh? I do. Yeah. I do, I, although I use it not nearly enough, I have to admit. That's one of my New Year's you're, resolutions. You're working all the time. Man. Yeah. Yeah. I just have too much else going on. Or not enough prioritizing. Yeah. <laughs>